Welcome to Creative World. In this video, we will solve Chapter 2, Exercise Problem Number 2.50. While solving this problem, we will be using Current Divider Rule. Basic equations for the calculation of current I1 and I2 for this particular circuit using Current Divider Rule is provided here. We also will be using parallel equivalent resistance calculation formula for two parallel connected resistances. R equivalent is equal to the product of both parallel connected resistances divided by their sum. Now move towards the problem. Exercise problem number 2.50. Find current IA in given below figure. This is the circuit diagram of given problem. We have to find the value of current IA inside this branch. This problem can be solved using different techniques but we will adopt current divider rule to solve this problem because it is the easiest technique to apply on this problem. We know that in order to apply current divider rule we should have only two parallel connected resistances across a current source. But in this circuit there are four number of parallel connected resistances and we are not interested to calculate their current. Our main point of concerning is this branch so we will try to simplify this network by taking the equivalent resistance of these parallel connected resistances. For that purpose we will use equivalent resistance calculation formula of two parallel connected resistances. We will start from left side of circuit. First we will try to find the equivalent resistance of 4 kilo ohm and 1 kilo ohm resistance. In this case I am assuming 4 kilo ohm is R1 and 1 kilo ohm is R2. Place the values of R1 and R2 inside this equation to calculate their equivalent resistance that will be equal to the product of both resistances divided by their sum. Product of 4 and 1 will become 4 and sum of 4 and 1 will become 5k. Now divide 4k by 5k the answer will be 0.8k. Now we can replace these two parallel connected resistances with a single equivalent resistance that have the value of 0.8k. Now inside the circuit there are total three number of resistances that are connected in parallel connection. We will try to further simplify this network. We will try to find the equivalent resistance of this 0.8 kilo ohm and 2 kilo ohm resistance. In this case we are assuming 0.8 kilo ohm resistance is R1 and 2 kilo ohm resistance is R2. So place the value inside this equation to calculate their equivalent resistance that will become product of both resistances divided by their sum product of 0.8k and 2k will become 1.6k and sum of 2k and 0.8k will become 2.8k. Now divide 1.6k with 2.8k the answer will be 0.57k. So we can replace these two parallel connected resistances with a single resistance having the value of 0.57 kilo ohm. Now we have only two parallel connected resistances. We will try to find out the accumulative current of these two current sources so that we can apply current divider rule on this network. If we observe on this node one current is leaving from this node that is 7 mA and one current is entering to this node that is 3 mA. So the resultant current of both current sources will become 4 mA and it will be leaving from this node. And this resultant is calculated by simply subtracting entering current from leaving current. So modify the circuit according to the calculated current. This 4 mA current is leaving from this node. Now at this stage we are able to apply current divider rule on this circuit. For that purpose we will label the branch currents. This branch current will be labeled as I1 and this branch current will be labeled as I2. And we are interested to calculate the value of current I1 because it is equal to current IA due to same branch. 
सो द इक्वेशन ऑफ करंट डिवाइडर रूल फॉर दिस करंट आई वन विल बी आई वन इज इक्वल टू आर टू डिवाइडेड बाई आर वन प्लस आर टू मल्टीप्लाई बाई आई इन टू टी इन दिस इक्वेशन आई इन टू टी इज टोटल सप्लाइड करंट दैट इज फोर मिलियम पेयर इन आवर केस आर टू इज फाइव किलो एंड आर वन इज पॉइंट फाइव सेवन किलो सो प्लेस वैल्यूज इन साइड दिस इक्वेशन to calculate the value of current i1 that will be equal to 5k divided by 0.57k plus 5k multiplied by 4 milliampere solve this equation take the sum of 5k and 0.57k it will become 5.57k divide 5k with 5.57k and multiply it with 4 milliampere the value of current i1 will become 3.59 पॉइंट फाइव नाइन मिली एम्पेयर एंड दिस करंट आई वन इज इक्वल टू आई ए सो द वैल्यू ऑफ करंट आई ए इन साइड दिस नेटवर्क इज थ्री पॉइंट फाइव नाइन मिली एम्पेयर सो दिस वॉज एक्सरसाइज प्रॉब्लम नंबर टू पॉइंट फाइव जीरो थैंक यू सी यू अगेन इन नेक्स्ट वीडियो